Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be able to share this latest product with you. Um, I just took it all out of the package, so I haven't even had a chance to play with it yet. But I wanted to share with you while I'm setting it up, and then I will test it out with some other things and let you know what I think of it. Um, so. As you know, I do a lot of these videos. Um, I am constantly sharing things that I get, and I wanted to branch into more types of support types of, boy, am I a little redundant today, more support types of videos for small business owners and people looking for marketing help. So I have been in the process of trying to up my game with better equipment, um, one of those being a good microphone. I'm hoping that this solves my problem with that. So I picked up the Zeal Sound plug and play broadcasting recording uh, microphone with a mini desktop stand that I will be using from now on um, if it works out for me and has good sound quality. And I wanted to share it with you right now. So here is your microphone. You see it's small. It's not heavy. I mean, it's fairly lightweight. On the bottom, you can see you have your microphone, um, you've got your aux cable, you've got your headphones where you would plug in, and then you have got your charging port for it. It comes with the micro USB charger so that you can charge it up. Um, as with most products, it does ship with a little bit of a battery charge, but who knows how long that will last, so always charge up your devices to full power before you really give them a good testing to understand how good they're gonna be and how long that charge is going to last. Um, but you also have, besides your, your on and off switch here and your blue indicator light that tells you it's on, you have control of the echo, which is just a sliding switch so you can adjust how much of it you want. And you have your volume, same thing, sliding switch, whereas the other one is a hard switch. Um, so there's the microphone. Uh, it also comes with your aux cable to be able to work with and it comes with the micro USB and the aux cable um, plug on the other side. I don't even know what that, that kind of a cord is called, but it's all there. You also get in it the um, stand itself. So here is the little mini tripod stand that you have for it. You see, easy, plug and play, set it up. The top part has a screw on the side that you can adjust it with. It's a little bit loose right now to be able for me to manipulate it without having to tighten it, but you can just get a Phillips screwdriver and tighten that down once you get the um, angle that you want. It has these rubber band-like things on it that come off that allow you to hold the microphone in place, which is definitely an interesting design on that, I guess. Um, it comes with replacement rubber bands that you can use as well, but I'm sure that any rubber band would work in the same manner since all it does is just snaps around the, the different areas here. So you see, you just wrap it up around to put it into place. Oh, as I pop it completely off because I'm trying to do it without looking at things. Um, but yeah, simple to put these on. So once you get your microphone in place, it shouldn't be a hard thing to adjust it to the tension you want, doubling them up, tripling them, however you want to do it. And any rubber band will work for that. Um, but you have all of your rubber bands, your replacements there. Um, I'm not sure how many are in that package. There, I finally got it. it took me a few tries. Um, it looks like maybe three replacements in here. You also have the, um, uh oh, what's this called? I forgot now. Brain dead. Um, you've got your um, screen to go over it. And your screen, it's just a little mesh um, cotton type screen to help with um yeah you got your screen okay but you've got I'm, I'm thinking too head far ahead here and my mouth is not keeping up but you've got the mounting bracket here that's got a screw on it that goes in the end of that and then just tighten that up on it and then you can tighten the screw the nut on the end of it to hold it into place so that you have that this then slides into the pieces on the end of it here 
so that you can put it on at whatever, however, whatever size you want. And it's got these little tightening ones here that you use, what do I have on my hand? That you use to clamp it down into place. Easy to set up. I was able to figure it out without even looking at instructions, so that should say something there. But you can see, you can then adjust it to whatever you want what, and get your microphone slid into place where you want it and you're good to go. So I'm gonna test it out, see how it works. Um, I'm gonna charge it up first, but I will test it out and then go from there and let you know what I think. Um, you may notice some sound quality improvements in my videos if everything does work out the way I'm hoping it does. Um, but no guarantees, so I will have a complete written um, review letting you know all of my thoughts, showing you all of the pictures of everything that I've shown you on the camera so far um, in my on my website, which is linked up in the description down below. And I will also have the link for you to buy it on Amazon. It is $24.98 on Amazon with Prime, and it's got some pretty good reviews on there so far. There's only eight of them, so... We'll see how well I do with it, and I'll let you know what I think. Um, but other than that, I like plug and play. Um, it says simply plug in and start recording, and high compatibility with Windows, iOS, Android, iPad, Mac, iPhone, I, um, iPhone, phone, computers, and laptops, which I use quite a few of those. So I'm gonna test it out with a few different things just to see what the sound quality is, and we'll report back on that as well in the written review. So on that note, I'm going to wrap it up here and go plug it in so that I can test it out. So make sure you like my video, drop me some comments if you have any about recording, give me some tips because I've never used a microphone before, I just use the built-in microphone in my phone when I'm recording. And make sure that you have subscribed to my videos so that you can see other things that I have coming because I just got a huge shipment in and have tons of stuff to take out and to get pictures of. So you don't want to miss out on anything that I've got coming next. And other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.